Um, and so that's just some kind of stuff. We this is a den for us. We live up in our house. We got you know, we we just do, you know. So um <laughs> anyway, so the mattress was there and I was laying on it and I had my phone right in front of me with my chin like off the end of the mattress. Um, and then I had uh put the crystals on my Okay, I put the crystals on my right side of the phone and I kind of once I realized I did have them in a funny spiral shape. Right. And then I put I had a bag of popcorn and I get this popcorn from Sam's Club. I came something pop or whatever. It's just like some kind of bland popcorn, but it tastes real good. And I had put the bag of popcorn on the left. And when I eat that popcorn, everybody get mad at me because it'd be getting all over the place. I had to vacuum 20 times a day. So anyway, um, you know, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I, that's just the only thing that was close enough to me to even bring up at this point. Okay. But again, just think when you're, when these things are happening, something is it, it, not just me saying, Oh, this matches this. No, something is like, it just stops and says, mm, this is reminding me. It's kind of like what we do with the Bible. Same thing, you know? Um, and, um, <laughs> Nam K. Okay. Uh, she suddenly stops, okay, after she has the stuff in a mag- uh, magical pattern. Again, I didn't put this in no pattern for no reason. It just reminded me of, of that. And it says, Sudden, suddenly she stopped uh, arrested by what formed in the spring, a vision. Now, I was watching somebody, and again, I'm not naming no names, right? I was watching somebody on TV, and again, now I'm tripping. Now, think we in some movie like, uh, why it look like that? Okay, think we in some movie <laughs> like, uh, what you call it? With uh, the Truman Show, or something like this, or even uh, in the American Gods when uh, Shadow Moon is in the store and the magazines and shit is talking to him, or in the first season when he was at the store and the TV was like, "Hey, you, yeah, you, or whatever." Okay, so think about something like that, but not like that. It's not on that level. It's just um. You know, I saw something on the screen that made me kind of gasp or whatever that somebody was saying um, that, again, it felt like it was directed towards. Okay, so anyways, that's just that. (laughs) Um, And it says my father, he uh, he sits in thought. A white scout lies in ambush. My father does not see the pale face raises um, his head and looks. Okay. My father does not see. The enemy lifts his musket, he aims, and she su- suppresses the screen. Okay. Now, I had a dream. And again, it, it hit me right now when I just d- explained this. It didn't even hit me the first time. Um, in a house that I lived in probably about 12 years ago, actually, it was my dad's house <laughs> um, that I was renting from him. Um, and, uh, I kept having this dream of him passing away by a gunshot in like a ditch or something, but it felt like it was outside of a bar or something like that, like on an old uh, road or something like that. But at the end of the day, now that I'm thinking about, because I couldn't really see his face, but I just felt like I knew it was somebody that was similar to my dad or very close. Now, um, and I don't know if I showed you guys in those images that strange object that is underneath the grass in the front yard but that's kind of like the same exact ditch you see what i'm saying it's kind of like the same exact scene that that thing occurred in it's hard to describe okay but um and my dad don't go to bars so i don't know but that just is what i just wanted to bring that up um and then Again, it says that she suppresses a scream. Singing bird says, what then? What then? Did he fire? Uh, did Black Hawk fall? Now, again, this is reminding me of something of, again, hopefully this is working for you guys, um, of my dad saying that he woke up and somebody was trying to give him something um, at the hospital, right? Um, and I said, yeah, don't let them put you on no ventilator and don't let this and that happen. And I was just calling him every day, a couple times a day, just to go, just to check on him. Um, and, uh, I felt bad cause I couldn't go, but again, look what we're dealing with. So, <clears throat> so yeah. And then he said, I was like, Mm-mm, I don't want no more of that or whatever. 
and they were only supposed to keep him for one day but then it turned into like three days and so i was three or four days so i was just around this i couldn't even think straight right so anyways it says um <clears throat> um namke peering in vain um says it is gone <clears throat> excuse me i see no more is this to be okay and singing bird says he thinks no enemy can harm him while he is in the spirit. And Namke, okay, says the vision is the spirit's warning. Okay. Rouse the warriors and send them up the hill. Okay. Now this is their story back then. And it says singing bird says there are none in the village. They are hunting and fishing. What shall we do? And uh, um, it says, Namke, making her hands like a trumpet, uh, directed up, back to the right. Blackhawk, pause. Blackhawk, they listen, okay? Now, I have a thing that I do. <laughs> when I'm going into something, all right? And again, I just really hope you guys are enjoying this. If not, you know, you can let me know. I just stop. No, I won't. <laughs> so anyways, um, I have this thing that I do when I'm thinking or I'm just in something and I do like something like, you know, I don't know why I do this. I'm like, oh, or something like that. I just do this thing. Right. <laughs> so, you know, it's just tripped me out. It's just, what you, I don't know. It's just some, hmm. I guess it's just me that just pay too much attention to shit. I just can't, I'm just a person that pay attention to details like, a lot when it comes to certain things. Some other things don't work like that. <laughs> um, and then Namke says, I will run for Nam Samsi. But there were two in the village. Wata. Now I'm messing up these names, but it is what it is. Okay. Uh, Wata Isa E and Tiama. They came from the sunrise with my father. They were asleep in the lodge of Na, of Nama. Send them with weapons up to the hill. Singing bird, yes. Um, go swiftly, but fetch Namsamsi. Namke starts off right front of the river, but sees her crystals. Okay, she runs back, gathers them into a jar, and then starts to run. But looking forward on her path, she stops abruptly. Namsamsi comes running from the right front. He sees her, but passes towards the left not intending to stop. Namke says, uh, where are you going, Namsamsi? And Namsamsi, <laughs> uh, stopping, who was shouting Blackhawk? Who was shouting Blackhawk? Okay. Uh, Namke, after pointing to herself, go up quickly to the grave of Nam Nanamaki. Blackhawk is there in prayer. Our mother dreamed. In the spring, the vision showed a white scout uh, firing at our father. Namsamsi, I have seen more than a vision. I saw five white uh, skulkers in the hollow of the river. They tra uh, trailed my father from the fort, and now they're trailing me. Nam come, uh, okay, now, listen. All right. Okay. So, <laughs> now, this whole thing here, it's a little bit too dramatic for me to go into it tonight. It is. It's really. Is that that part is going to be very draining. So what I'm going to do is just finish this page up here, um, and then we'll we'll come back to that one in the next. Look at y'all looking at me. Ugh. Okay, stop. <laughs> um. So, anyways, uh, skulkers in the hollow, um, up the river. They trailed my father from the fort, and now they're trailing me. Namke then the vision is true. Now, okay, so I was saying when he was in the hospital, right? Now, what if, because I, I want to say right before that, one of my uncles was in the hospital, okay? My dad ended up get, going into the hospital, and I think another one of my uncles is in the hospital right now. If I'm not mistaken, I have to call um, and check in on, on him. Um, call my cousin and find out more. But... Um, Anyhow, when my dad was there, I'm thinking, you know what? Just the way this thing is, I know they're looking for something, okay, when it comes to 
are people that's going into the hospital. Okay. So when it comes to that, I was joking around saying, you know, what if I said we, my whole family hadn't been tested. Uh, we probably got sick and for a couple of days or whatever, people might've thought it was that, but we all just nursed each other back to health. Each one took, the, took the seat, you know, um, but we, you know, we hadn't been tested or anything. And so I, and I want, I liked it that way. Right. And then I was like, well, damn, you know, if they is, you know, looking for stuff in people's blood or whatever, you know, to keep track, you know, what if they could be doing that and then uh, jotting this stuff down for some of us that are waking and doing some of these things that's going on with us at these times, right? Or what if they're looking for certain bloodlines or whatever that have certain amount of whatever. You know, I just be seeing stuff sometimes. I be as, when me and my oldest daughter, we just be going back and forth sometimes. And that don't mean we believe everything. We're just asking questions, you know? So, um, and I, I remember saying something like, mm, uh, what if, you know, they found something and now, because I think I was saying, why was it feeling like somebody was watching? We had cars pulling up funny in front of the house and things like that. And I was like, hmm, you know, what if that's the case, you know? So again, it's, it's that doesn't really have much to do with it, but it kind of does, okay? Um, and Singing Bird says he will hear nothing, okay? And Nam, Nam, Nam K, I will run for Nam Samsi. But there were two in the village. Uh, oh, we already read that part. Y'all, okay, I, I probably shouldn't even did this tonight, okay? We'll finish this one page. I must rouse the warriors and lead them back. There are only two. Our mother has gone for them. Go up the hill. Two. Um, those five could burn our lodges. Well, um, I make three. Uh, bring Black Hawk down. He will make four. The women husking, uh, tell them to run and call the fishers. Uh, but, but our father, uh, she looks up the path to the hill. He will not see them coming. The whites will not go up the hill. I saw the white scout aim at him. Uh, Nam Samsi, how can I protect him without men? Uh, do as I bid you. He points imperiously to the village. She looks back dis uh, despairingly, then obeys, passing in front of him to the left. Um, he gives a keen look back along his trail and then swiftly follows. The woods are silent. The light is turned to a red glow and, uh, sorry, to a red gold, the light of the Mississippi Valley sunset. Okay. Now it says that Elijah Robbins and Jack Street enter uh, fur furtively right, front, crouching and peering ahead, reading Namsam C's trail. Um, they stop center, looking uh, right near left front. Um, Robbins, okay, suddenly ducks down and says, look out, Jack, woman working in that field. Don't let them see us. They lay down behind the rocks of the spring and peer left front. Street, okay, says Robbins, we're running straight into the biggest Indian town in the, in the uh, continent. That'll be Sakonok around that bend. He points. That's where the young buck went, okay? Okay, that part is deep, y'all. And I don't even really want to go into it because it was kind of traumatizing for me, okay? Um, I tell you, he saw us. I'll just tell you that something happened at my house where somebody in an unmarked Amazon... And again, we haven't, we haven't already talked about stuff like this, about them taking pictures at your front. You know how uncomfortable some of this stuff is and how some they use so many different you know vehicles. We don't know who these drivers... When it, Not even just them. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to any of these companies... Um, the people that bring the food, all this stuff. You just never know who can be getting information. It's just, but we already talked about how they be giving up information. So, I mean, it's not no secret. Um, <clears throat> but was sitting, I had, we had all left, okay? But there was only two left in the house. Now, this is talking about somebody named Street, but this van was parked on the street 
for 40 minutes. And my daughter called me and said, mom, there's a van parked outside, been sitting out there for like 30 minutes or more. Um, 